we start with weekly chart just i want to give a quick update and as you can see based on weekly chart the price we had this really sharp move and the price broke the, all the previous top and uh, right now i want to see what sticks what's the next and we're looking at this one as a correction whether this is a deeper correction for continuation or not anyway Based on the weekly chart, we don't see any opportunity. I mean, we don't have much information to discuss. And mostly we are, really ex we are expecting to see the deeper correction for continuation. And if we move to daily chart, similar ex explanation. But how deep this one can go? If the price continue, even we can expect the price. For me, I'm expecting if the price couldn't reverse from here, we can expect the price drop to 42 cent. Anyway, we are more interested to look for the reversal. That means we are more interested to look for buy. And if you move to the forward chart, right now we can consider this one as a long running flat as a first. And if you want to put this one as a last wave, the best thing is if the price could at least tag the previous low, following by divergence before we look for the reversal. Because if the price reverses from here with the breakout of the previous top, we can expect this one turn to a correction in relative to this. All right. Now, which one we should take it? Mostly, I'm looking for this one to see you next drop. Because I don't think we can call this one as the ABC. All right. Anyway, as I mentioned, for me, I'm not really interested to look for sell from here unless this one turns to a deeper correction. If we get any sell with the breakout of the previous low, we have to start to manage it. But if the price could break this, the lowest price of this move, then any reversal from there will take it. All right. It doesn't mean the price cannot continue from here. We can expect this one turn to a deeper correction before we see the next drop. But as a long term, we explain what we're looking for. And based on forward chart, we don't see any trade setup. And if the price reverses from here as a corrective, mostly we can look for the next drop. All right. And if I move to one hour chart, even based on one hour chart, what I can see here, I don't see any trade setup in there for buy or sell. Because if the price is going to continue and drop as a flag, we can look for the sell and with the breakout based on one hour chart. At first, with the breakout of this low, we have to move our stop loss to break even. Then we want to see whether we can look for continuation or not. And even if we want to look for buy, maybe if this one turned to a correction, we can put our entry for here above this stuff for the next sharp move. But at this point, I'm not really, and we don't see any trade setup. And even we can expect this one turn to a flat. That's why better we wait. We are not really interested to look for the short-term sell either for buy or sell. Right now, we have to wait. For me, I'm preferring to wait and see how deep this one can go. We can put this one as a correction relative to this for one move up. We want to see whether the price can break the previous top or not. That's mean we can look for buy within this range. But as I mentioned, I've, at this point, I don't see really clear picture for the next trade. I prefer to wait before I make a next decision. Because as I mentioned, if you want to look for buy, the only way is to put a one tree above the top, which I don't suggest that. Anyway, we just follow the chart. For As a long term, we're looking for the reversal. But as what I explained based on daily chart, maybe we move to forward chart, it will be more clear. We want to conform with this move. Before we see there, we look for buy. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.